Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Up here! Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ. Tintu. What are you guys doing? I was looking for more pencils. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? For? out there. Someday, maybe you'll meet one. That would be cool. Super cool. Now, give me in. No, he's mine now. You know what they are. Okay, okay. That's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. It's mine. No, it's not. Ugh, fine. Thanks. Do you I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Hey, what'd you find? Of Marlon and Lewis. Stay back. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Sit, girl. See? She's harmless. She just needs to get to know you is all. Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? <laughs> Sorry. I promise she's not gonna... <sighs> okay. I guess. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. <laughs> That's so cool! See? Now Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. She was a master's dog, back when this place was still fun. He bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow, well, what a dick. <laughs> Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like it if you and AJ were a part of that. Both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. We end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. I didn't realize how much for. Greenhouse. Oh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. Had plenty of vegetables growing, but it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we uh, we keep away from that now. Oh, 
hunting grounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed? Fuckers flooded in there after all the noise you made. One more thing. See these red lights? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. So, why not go outside it? <laughs> we can't. Whenever someone goes outside this... ...disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if... If I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost so much. Friends, siblings, I, I can't let another kid die. It could break us. <sighs> Sorry, I'm just, just a lot of pressure. Everyone's counting on me to step up, be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two more mouths to feed. But maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis... Uh, Violet and Brody are going up river to do some... And hopefully, those two get along long enough. Both teams could use some extra hands. We're gonna go fishing. Okay. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? I think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Go get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. See you around. You know, I've been thinking. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, bye. I've never driven in my life, but I'd love to learn. Well, I think it would be fun anyway. You seem to be the only one. Lay off, Brody. Are we going to the car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the call. I wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. But still, it's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted, if gas wasn't an issue. Or a busted carburetor, or flat tires, or the transmission. Buzzkill. I'd drive down to the coastline, maybe park on the beach and go swimming. That'd be... ...in the sun. And die of skin cancer. Fun. We're all gonna die... ...here my entire life. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kinda like to unknow it. Now you're dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. We got spears inside the shack. Come on. I'll stay out here. Where are those spears? Hey, up 
about by. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed. How do you even apologize for something that fucked up? Maybe I deserve it. You should talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll listen. <laughs> yeah, right. I tried. I have. It just never seems like the right time. We all used to be friends. <sighs> Guess I just kind of miss that. No. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone. Do you? I mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? See how she feels? Up inside. I can try, but I can't make any promises that it'll help. Thanks, Clementine. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. What the hell is taking you two so long? See? I'll take this to Vi. There should be some extras lying around. Hey you, what you looking at? Violet and Minerva. What does that mean? Friends. Like me and you are really good friends? Not exactly. Ready to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Can I join you? Sure. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess they don't realize it makes them easier targets. I wanna try. Take a spear. Go nuts. Go ahead and try. They're not running. Any luck? I got something. Good enough for me. Hey, um, sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. Sentimental by now. <laughs> uh. Don't sweat it. I'm glad we got to know each other. <laughs> yeah, I guess I am too. Like everybody. <laughs> Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. 
I got one. Pull him. I got one. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is between us. With Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. Because you blame her for what happened with the twins. Well, that's what I used to think. I just keep thinking that things might have ended differently if I was there. Maybe I could have protected Soph. And Minnie. She wants to talk about it, you know. I just... I feel guilty about the whole thing. Why? I was supposed to be out with the twins that day. I wanted to work in the greenhouse, so I asked Brody to cover for me. But then... I didn't even get to say goodbye. I... I want... Every time I tried, I was reminded of who we lost. It was easier to just not talk about it. We should get going. You guys catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Sim, see if they had any better luck. The Grand Canyon. Driving until we hit the Grand Canyon. Yeah, that would be cool. Thanks. Hey, you slow folks coming? Yeah, we're right behind you. Those guys. Practicing making out with a toothless walker? Gross. I know. Poor walker. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? What? This isn't normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A Sam? Lewis! Spread out. See if we can find them. Watch out for monsters. Empty. Huh. Is this a Bible page? Sim, found something. Monster. Guys, over here! Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. <sighs> Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. It's just a pen. I, I have to tell Marlon... ...to live? We definitely don't have enough. Figure it out. I'll take this hall back to school. Maybe we can ration out something. What do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlin kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? <sighs> Let me think.
The train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but it's outside the safe zone. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. So much there. Or we could starve. Fine. Let's go. There. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. Could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. Close. Sounds scary. There's a reason. I need to get in there. Bell might be able to get the walkers' attention. They do like to follow sound. You look like you've got an idea. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. I think... ...until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then, I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! These will be perfect. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Just in case. 
just in case. Stand. Slowly. I won't hurt you. I don't have to. What do you want? I just want food. already and organized some effort to get inside so you probably also knew the stash was there I've seen those cigarettes before but it was an honest mistake I can be a real butterfinger sometimes You look a little young to be out on your own. You got a group. Count you plus the two outside, I'm thinking maybe more. You got a camp in these here woods? Tell me about your group first. <laughs> uh, I miss the days when we were all so goddamn cagey. It's just me and my ugly face out here. Lonely, ugly, and hungry. I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. <clears throat> well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. Listen up, Squirt. Just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. Like it never happened. You wouldn't let a hungry man starve now, would you? AJ, shoot! <laughs> I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this. <clears throat> well, hey there, Squirt. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. Me and let me go my Mary. You understand? AJ, get down! <laughs> 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 Listening to me, Marlon. 
Listen to me, I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? A Sim! Mitch! Food! That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You are a savior. Save me first. <laughs> where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. Nope. I shoved him into a pack of walkers. They took a chunk out of him. It was awesome! Look, I don't know if he got If he did, he won't make it for long. You attacked him? What the fuck? If he survived, you know he's coming back for revenge! What the hell were you thinking? <sighs> this is fucked. If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the Think again. Safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough. Just means there's a hungry. It's happened before. You are overreacting. Can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. happens. I'm holding you responsible. Clem. Help. You did. You did. But... Shit. It was risky, but it was worth it. Like you said, we can't lose another kid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did say that. <clears throat> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. Ever since we lost Buffy and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by any. She'll be all right eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I think I'll go too. See you later. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? Nice. I doubt it. Me too. But it's not like you can go ask one. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where... Sophie was awesome at making stuff. She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. I guess that doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah, I think so too. A lot better than some smelly old school. The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably look. Some the way they probably left them. 
But sometimes I draw this. Can can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. You just got to hold still. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Here you go. It's yours. It's ours. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. 